Hi, support from Trade the Fifth. Back on November the 17th, 2018, I made a short video on Facebook and Apple talking about our black box breakout indicator and how we can use it for swing trading. I just want to follow up on Facebook in particular with from there uh, and show you how to combine our black box breakout indicator suite with our Elliott Wave indicator suite to continue trading these types of swing trades. So first of all, just to remind you, this indication back down on the left here, over, over on the left here, 156.86, where my blue arrow is. This was our original entry for the short breakout using our black box breakout indicator here. So I'm just going to put those lines on here. There we print our software prints out automatically the entry here. And also the stop loss, the, the, the red line there, 164.085. Uh, we'll just round that up a little bit. But I'm just going to put those lines in to show you how powerful this black box breakout indicator is so there you go there was the original entry it did not come back and still has not come back to even test the stop loss of that original entry there so the original entry is 156.86 we tipped 124 dollars yesterday uh, even 123 dollars yesterday so really you know a 33 dollar move on this trade now Obviously, you're going to trade this uh, and if we get a big pullback like we just have done now, you're going to take profit. But look how our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite now allows you to measure this wave for pullback. It finds resistance in our big EMA cloud here and in our automated probability pullback zones and then comes down for an entry for a fifth wave trade. And we hit the fifth wave target on the 24th of December. So even if you didn't get in this first original uh, breakout trade here, there was another opportunity down on this one. And then we've had a wave four pullback and now we've traded the fifth wave. And if you had um, got in this first entry and, and managed this sensibly, you'd have gone, you'd have made a $33 move on Facebook down here. So it just goes to show you everything works out very, very well with this. Uh, combining breakout strategies, getting in that third wave early for the breakout up here, trading the fifth wave, combining these two indicator suites gives you a really good opportunity to swing trade longer term uh, on some of these big names, the FANG stocks in particular, um, but any type of stock, this is really, really good. Just go through this wave four pullback again. So remember on our wave four pullback, we, the first sign is we get this resistance in our probability zones. This green zone is an 85% probability. If that resistance holds, we're gonna go on and make that new wave five high into our automated target zones, which it has done. The next is a 535 oscillator. This wave four pullback has pulled back between 90 and 140% of the, of the wave three. Then the stochastic has crossed over in the overbought zone against the main bearish trend there. And also you see on our multiple time frame dot cloud, which is part of the black box breakout indicator, you can see how this wave four pulls back here. Our dot cloud goes from red to cyan on two different time frames here and then starts to pull back again as we go down on the fifth wave. So we can measure those pullbacks over multiple time frames using this. So again, combining two indicator suites to really make some um, some big moves on Facebook. So I just thought I'd share that with you. Have a great training day. Speak to you all soon.